<laughs> yeah. Exactly, Kuro. I'll just use the... Oh, wait, no. Can you check my hands again? Look how smooth they are. He don't talk to you when you're on your horse. Go on, Who knows? Okay. He ain't, he ain't talking about stuff anymore. Alright. Gloves. These beautiful gloves don't matter. I, I see that now. <laughs> Alright. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go to the map. And we're gonna look at a. We're gonna plan a new place. We're gonna get rid of this beacon. We went up here, eh? So I think I want to dedicate my time trying to get into the academy. So let's go here. Let's go into the academy. I need to try to get in here. You can craft some stuff with the flowers. I'll tell you about it. I'll show you. I was seeing if I could talk to my friend, but I can't. All right, item crafting. So what can I make that are throwing pots? Um, I can make roped holy water, holy water, poison sleep, roped. Okay. So these are the things I can craft. And cream is not what I have right now. I can make pickled turtleneck. I can make spellproof dried liver, staunching boluses, sleep pot, but I can always get more recipe books too. Oh, let's see what's up here. Did I get quieter? It's, it could have been my microphone uh, tilting away. Oh, the meeting place map. You found a simple map. Check in inventory. Interesting. What does this say? Okay. Key required ahead. Therefore, seek dragon. Oh, I gotta fight a dragon, huh? Seek dragon. Key? Yeah. I've seen dragons. I know where they are. Um, at least some of them. Everybody wants to tell me that. Alright. Let's look at the meeting place. Let's look at the map. We got a map. Okay. Here it is. Simple map found on a corpse. Seems to point to a meeting place. The man it came from surely desired one. The sole means of gaining entry into the academy. A glintstone key. Indeed, we need that key. Alright, so let's look. He says that on an island... To the west of the academy is a meeting place? Let me look at the big map. Yeah, over here, there's something here. So I guess we can go check that out. All right, now, given that, let's see, which way is it down here? Can I just jump down there and survive? I mean, it looks pretty safe. Hi, everybody. Oh, yeah. I'm totally going to make it if I jump over the edge. Yep. Yeah. Hi, is it okay if I ride back here? No? I only took half of my health, so that's not too bad. Oh god, but that's bad. Okay, that flower wants my, my corpse. Look, you can't have it. I'm going to take all these runes. It's my job. All right, we're riding along in the swamp. It's really a beautiful swamp. Breathtaking. Mushroom. Need it. Yeah, Fading. It's just a ridiculously well-crafted and beautiful game. I mean, look at this. This is the academy. So this is like the campus for the Wizards Academy, the Magic Academy. And the whole place is underwater. Like, all of the buildings, you can see the ruined... The, this is the temple quarter. 
you could see the tops of the uh, <laughs> the old structures just barely standing above above the water. Then there's some really handsome folk guarding it. I come here for the beautiful people. Oh, here's a side of grace. Let's get it. <laughs> it is Hogwarts. Underwater Hogwarts. Nope. Alright. Nobody to talk to here. Okay. So this is the meeting place. It was over here. Ooh, there's all these floating death balls, though. What are these things all about? Are you nice? Do you mind if I kill you? Maybe? Hey, hey, Dr. Octagonopus. What is up, my friend? Good to see you. How you been? I'm just playing some Elden Ring, riding around, killing things I shouldn't, that are going to kill me. Just the usual. All right, here's what we're going to do. Oh, this is what they're talking about. Seek the dragon. Now, maybe I don't have to fight the dragon. Maybe this is one of those um, friendly dragons, you know? What's this say? Try rot. Oh, okay. So rot damage would hurt this thing. Um, I'm going to just preemptively summon my buddies. Just in case. And we're going to go talk to the drags. Okay, the drags isn't talking. Glimstone dragon. Smarog. Oh, God. Uh, this is not right. I am dead. I didn't make it. Um, I'm doing great, my friend, except for the dragon. Oh, gosh, Dr. Octagon Post. That rune doku was brutal. Vigor check? Is that what it is, Distro? I need more vigor. My vigor is not good, so I just need more hit points, basically, to fight the dragon. All right, well. Yeah, so um what one thing that can you can do is uh if I activate this, I can summon another player to help me with the dragon and there are places where um sometimes I have to do that. Horseback battle. Yeah, horseback isn't bad, except it was doing so much damage to me. It was really quite breathtaking. All right, nobles. Ring that bell. So let's see what this dragon does. All right, there's a pretty uh, dangerous-looking breath of fire. Okay, fireballs that uh, try to kill me. Ride! You know what the problem here also is? Um, this is a glintstone dragon, which glintstone is magic. And so uh, that's basically how I do damage. So I don't think he's going to take much damage at all from my attacks because I do magic damage. So this might be one of those things where it's like um, I need a different way to kill something. I hit it in the private parts. I think we can all agree that that's just what happened. 
My horse. My god. You didn't have to do that. Look at my nobles. They're like cowering in terror. Oh, God. Okay. So, everybody, I think it's safe to say that I'm not ready for that fight. And I'm going to need, obviously, <laughs> more, more stuff to handle that, right? I'm going to need a d different magic spells. Something that's not necessarily doing that kind of damage. Or just to be stronger overall. So, we'll look for something else to do. That was interesting, without question. Uh, but a little bit too deadly. All right, let's see if I can get up here. Um, oh, this is pointing. So, this wants me to go up this way. Okay, sure. We can follow the light. If I follow the light... Now look at the tree. Beautiful. The air tree says, hello. And I say, hello to you. And I want to go there. Let's kind of mark this on the map. I've got no class. I hit the dragon in the unmentionables. All right, this is the King's Realm Ruins, which I've actually done. So I don't need to go exploring in here because I did... I cleared these out, but then I abandoned this area. Because there was a promise. I was told uh, of a... Is this a secret door? What is everybody saying here? Oh, oh, hey, 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 hey. I don't appreciate that. No, 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 no. That's a shameful, cowardly attack that you've got going. Where are you? Hey, no. How dare you? Yeah, that's right. Astrologer. That's my class. Now you've got it. All right. Look, buddy. You're going to pay for that. Oh, we made it through. There we go. That's all I needed to do. Oh, hi. He's like, hey, I was invisible a second ago. Oh, God. Nice cape. Oh, cool, Kuro. That sounds like a great idea. Have a great night, my friend. You have to let me know how that is. Ooh, look at this big guy. Does he want to talk to me? Can I talk to big man? Thank you, Kuro. I appreciate that, my friend. You too. Look at this guy's helmet. It looks like it's made of little windows. And he's got a... Is this an anvil? Are you like a blacksmith? Hello? Well, look at you. Look at me. We don't receive many visitors. We? I presume you are uh, tarnished. I'm very tarnished. What brings you here? Anvil. Oh, pardon me. It's hardly my place to ask, is it? I, I appreciate I you. E.G. E.G. A blacksmith who once served the Karian royals. Okay. An old codger who refuses to retire his rusty hammer. An old so codger. I am still quietly plying my trade on this spot. Perhaps you'd like a display? I would. These bones are old, but still able. Okay, we're talking about the same thing, right? All right, so um, what can I buy from you? Oh, he sells smithing stones. That's very attractive. Okay, great. But these are all sombers. Okay, um, can I go back and... Can you... Uh, strengthen my armaments? Can you strengthen this? It's going to require... Smithing stones level 3 and 480 gems. I can actually level this up. I have the stuff. I just don't have the runes. But I can get the runes. Don't you... Don't you worry about that. Please take oh, care. Watch out there. When I'm absorbed in my smithing, I lose sight of all else. If you come too close, I'm apt to cause you harm. I am, after okay. all, 
terribly large compared to you. Tommy. I'm glad you noticed that. You don't know how hard it is not to break anything while I work. It must be tough. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go s use some items here. So in my inventory, I have a bunch of runes. All right, I don't need that many, so I'm gonna use like three of these. Crush it. That's how I make money. All right, then. Something else for you? Oh God, yeah, something else. Strengthen my armament. Boost up my shield. Or no, not well. My you could do my shield, but no. How about my staff? Let's make this even better. Yeah, dude. Look at him working with his giant hammer. It's hilarious. He's like tap tap. Let me try not to break it. Now, what would it take to raise this up? Six smithing stones, level three. Brutal. Um, okay, we could definitely level this up, but there's really no reason. Yeah, let's talk. Brave tarnished. A word of warning, if you please. Okay, buddy. This territory once belonged to the Carian royal family. Their manor lies not far beyond this point. Okay. When the Rhea Lucari Academy turned on the Carians, the Knights of the Cuckoo descended on this track. The Cuckoo? After leveling it, they carried on to the manor. The Carians were taken off guard, but their strength had not waned, and they repelled the Knights' onslaught by conjuring an enchanted snare that remains potent to this day. Oh, boy. That is why I say tarnished. Don't go near the manor, unless you wish to lie with the corpses of the heedless knights of the Cuckoo. Um, okay, but look how inviting that manor is. I mean, it's like Resident Evil 4. I want to go see it. Can I? Can you please give me your secrets, big guy? I've explained the peril. Yes, you have. Of the enchanted snare that remains at the Royal Carrion Manor. I remember that. Whatever you do, brave tarnished. Stay away from that death trap. So, he wants me to stay away. What do you think he's reading in that giant book? I mean, that that book is quite large. I've explained of the enchantment. Nah, he doesn't have any more information now. Look, buddy, I need you to get me through it. All right, fine. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna just watch me die then. I'm gonna ride through this enchanted snare. Oh, I see it. There it goes. Sweet. All right, go, Torrent, go. You know, it's pretty slick what they did. You gotta admire it. Simple yet effective. Okay, I got hit. I didn't do a good job. Did I make it? I think I made it. That's right. I love how he's like, I told you, it's very dangerous. The Knights of the Cuckoo, they all died. Now, a little fact about the Knights of the Cuckoo. They don't have horses, and they walk um, single file to hide their numbers. And uh, they didn't get out of the way of the lightning death. It didn't go well for them. All right, we're in, people. Caria Manor. God, this place looks not safe. This is another reason why I really love this game. You know, in, in I love the other Dark Souls games for other reasons, but you just don't get environments like this in Dark Souls where it's like an, an open sky, you know, with this kind of wintry look through these coniferous trees and then these open expanses that are more brightly lit. It's a good feel. All right. I can summon, but I'll wait until I see... 
Actually, eh, I'm okay. But like, maybe I could rest at that side of grace. I'm not full. Seek. Oh, okay. Well, yes, indeed. We're missing some parts of the body here. I don't think I'm going to be finding any parts of the body, though. All right. I'll just take this item. Uh-oh. What was that? Hey. Oh, my God. It's a hand. No. It's it's like... It's got a ring. It's, it's two hands that have melded into... I don't even know what to say about that. You know, it's like Cousin It, but, uh... Hey, hey, Exanimo. Good to see you, my friend. How you doing? Hand in the sand, indeed. Hand, um... That has obliterated me. All right, we're getting the wolves, everybody. Ring the bell. Bring out the dogs. Oh, thing. Right, Cousin It was the hare. Thank you. That that makes sense. Okay. So let's see what we can do about that hand again. Is it just going to come rambling around? Where are you at, hand? There it is. Go get it, wolves. All right. Get out of here. Only thing about the wolves is that they take a lot of magic. Got it. Get out of here. Yeah. Thing. Ooh, it drops somber smithing stones. That's actually pretty sweet if you have items that level up with somber. I, I haven't even gotten good enough equipment yet to need somber, but I'll take it. All right, look at this. When you're exploring a haunted manor, tip number one is go places that are still preternaturally lit. All right, how's everybody doing? Wow, look at this room. You could have used some bookshelves, huh? Did They went for the book piling method. They've got the triple hourglass. I like it. The astrolab. A lot of alchemical work. Trap ahead. Uh-oh. Thank you for that clue. All right, if, there's, if there is indeed a trap here, I got to be ready for it. Glintstone Craftsman's Cookbook. Okay. But where's the trap? Ooh, if I knock out the... Oh, right there. Cool. It's written on the ground, too. It's like a glyph. That's sweet. Don't step on the glyphs. You will explode. All right, so this uh, cookbook that we got will let us craft some more stuff. And hopefully, you know, maybe we can use those ritual pots at some point. Uh, there's a baddie over there. Unless, I mean, you look like a... Oh, okay. Clever girl. Oh, it's a... Wow, look at this. I'm getting... I'm getting all sorts of uh, sass here from these magical cairn people. They've got glyphs. They've got cool spells that I haven't seen before. Like it. Try a ranged battle. Indeed, there's another hand down here. <laughs> magical Karens. Oh, God. We don't need to give the Karens any magic. Oh my god, it's... It's the mother and child. You know, this is, uh... Uh-oh. Hey, don't hit us. Oh my god, my dog jumped down there. What kind of... These wolves are really ad admirable. Look at that. They just jumped straight down. Drink it. Nah, they weren't full. They did go full, Leroy. They were just like, we'll protect you. Okay, thank you. Yeah. 
I mean, they're about to die, but they did a great job. All right, there's another hand over there. Uh, let's see about this. Somber. Ooh. Okay, we got to get this guy. Got it. And we got a carrion piercer. Sweet. Hey, hey, Lance. Good evening, my friend. How you doing? I'm exploring a haunted mansion in Elden Ring, Lance. It's, it's very disturbing. But I was able to give myself the patented beard on my character. So, things are well. Oh my god, look at all these hands. If these come out of the ground, I'm in such bad shape. Baby one I can take. Big one, no thank you. Oh my god, no, it's a big one. Oh my god, I got cornered. How'd that happen? My wolves! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's not looking good. Oh my god, it raised its middle finger at me. That's not polite. I think I got it. I, I mean, it flipped me the bird. They should censor that out. There needs to be a black bar censoring that out in the game. How dare they? That's disrespectful. On so many levels. All right. Okay, there's a nice fountain. Another hand. I know, Victory. It was... I mean, honestly, if I could raise my middle finger and, and cast a purple death beam out of it, it's worthy of consideration. Oh my god. That's... No. No, no. No, you may not do that. How dare you? Oh, I can't summon my horse. Go. Oh my god, there's that middle finger again. We need to call. This needs to be censored. I know, Black Cat. I would, I mean, it would add a real punch. Aw, oh, man. He's using that, that pedestal to his full advantage. I'm in bad shape because I don't have any magic left. I need to find... Like, another side of grace or something. Oh my god, we have no clue, Victory. That's a good point. I didn't even think about that, but that's really... It could have been anywhere. Whoa. I dodged it. I button hooked it. Don't, don't you dare hit me with that. Hey, old guy. Ghost man. How you living? That's a nice chair. Lady Ronnie, we have long awaited you. Where are you, Ronnie? I pray for your house's swift revival. May the full moon shine upon Caria. Oh no, this hand is sneaking in. You aren't allowed in here. This is my private chambers. I'm speaking with this ghost. Oh, okay, same thing. All right. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. If I have to go to eternity as a ghost, right? And I'm going to be haunting a spot for eh, presumably ever. I would like it to be in a chair. 